The Philippine Navy has started the process of acquiring a second decommissioned Pohang-class corvette from South Korea. The Philippine Navy made its intentions known more than a year ago by trying to acquire at least two more used Pohang-class corvettes to complement its existing surface ships as it replaces its World War II-era patrol vessels and expands its fleet. Is the acquisition process of the second Pohang-class corvette continuing? We sincerely hope that this process can be continued to be acquired and delivered to the Philippines as soon as possible. Previously, a joint visual inspection was conducted on the former Pohang-class flight IV Corvette Rox Andong, PCC-771. According to the Philippine Navy, the ship was found to be in good condition, although not much detail and timeline were provided on the transfer of the ship. Should the transfer be successful, it would be the second Pohang-class Corvette in the Philippine Navy, after the former Flight 3 ship Rox Chungju, PCC-762, now known as the BRP Conrado Yap, PS-39. In 2019 the Philippine Navy successfully acquired a decommissioned Pohang-class Corvette from South Korea named Corvette Rox Chungju, PCC-762 and the ship is now named BRP Conrado Yap, PS-39. The BRP Conrado Yap, PS-39, is a Pohang-class corvette currently commissioned with the Philippine Navy. She is the service's first modern corvette and one of its most heavily armed units. After four years of operation at sea, the Philippines Navy evaluated that the Korean patrol corvette is apt to be able to defend 7,107 islands and has the best conditions for coastal patrol and defense. The ROC Navy has transferred 40 ships to 10 friendly countries so far. These have been used as a means of facilitating defense cooperation and exports abroad with countries that received Korean vessels. South Korea retired three Pohang-class corvettes, all in the Flight IV variant, as well as five Chamshuri-class fast patrol boats just before the end of 2021. There is a huge likelihood that the Pohang-class corvettes will end up being offered to friendly countries like Vietnam and the Philippines. At the moment, the Pohang-class remains the most viable and fastest to obtain as temporary replacements for the Malvar-class patrol vessels and as force multipliers capable of anti-surface and anti-submarine warfare once the new offshore patrol vessels are commissioned. The Philippine Navy has already expressed interest in acquiring several more pohang class corvettes. It should be more aggressive in its request to take in more ships, especially now that it has a trump card to use. The selection of Hyundai Heavy Industries as the shipbuilder for two new corvettes, which also include Korean subsystems and munitions, including Sea Star anti-ship missiles and Naval Shield CMS, among many others. Max Defense PH believes that the PN should have at least six Pohang-class corvettes in two squadrons. Right now we have the Flight 3 Pohang-class corvette BRP Conrado Yap and are processing the transfer of the Flight IV ship Rox Andong, so hopefully four more can be requested from the SK government. The Pohang is a class of patrol combat corvette, PCC, of the Republic of Korea Navy, ROKN. A total of 24 ships were built by several South Korean shipyards, Korea Shipbuilding Corporation, Hyundai Heavy Industries, Daewoo Shipbuilding, and Korea Tacoma. The primary mission of the Corvette is coastal line patrolling. The Pohang class is deployed as a main force to monitor defense along the South Korean coast. These ships were equipped to perform anti-submarine, anti-ship, and anti-aircraft warfare operations in the littoral environment. As the Pohang-class ships are progressively being phased out of the ROC Navy, being replaced by the new generation Incheon-class frigates and then eventually by the FFX Batch 2 and FFX Batch 3. Several of the corvettes have been transferred to South Korea's allies, namely Peru, Vietnam, the Philippines, Colombia, and Egypt. The first in-class ship is now a museum in Pohang City. 
The 14th ship of the class, Rox Chiaonan, was sunk on March 26 by a torpedo launched by a North Korean Yono-class submarine, killing 46 sailors.